my husband and I have four children. Um, when Faith was in first grade, she needed occupational therapy for sensory processing. With, with Faith, we, we didn't know what was wrong, and we ended up at the CP Center to find out, well, wow, they, they can help with this. They, they were able to diagnose what the problem was and then get us onto a path of, well, how do we fix this? More than difficult. I was screaming and punching. She's a lot happier now. She's less upset if something doesn't feel right to her. We got her daughter back after all the therapy, taught us all the coping and ways to deal with the issues she has. Then David needed speech therapy, so we knew we were coming back here because of the service we had experienced in the past. He would mumble something. I didn't understand it. But Nathaniel and Faith would, and David would talk, and Amanda and I would just look at each other with the big question mark look on the face, like, what was that? And Nathaniel or Faith would translate. We knew where our problem with David was, is that he couldn't talk. Well, you're learning, you don't even notice because you have to do the vowel or the letter, and then you can like do the thing for the game. David is doing great and now in third grade. Then came Isaac, who also needed speech therapy, and we're back again, receiving the wonderful service that we've come to expect. Such a bubbly personality, super great little kiddo. He loves anything that we play. He's really, really easy to um, elicit some of these sounds with. He definitely enjoys some of the popping games that scare me, definitely. He really likes any game. He's always willing to do whatever, so he, that makes things really easy, too. The plane. I can't remember the name of the game. Kobu. You need to say the word, and then you they'll get the key, and you put it in the little hole, and then it pops up, and you try to get all the balls to open up the treasure chest. CP has worked wonders with them. Before CP, my brothers, I could hardly understand them, and now, unless they're trying to annoy me, I understand them almost 100% of the time. It's emotional. It's very emotional knowing that these people love our family and our children and all of their clients as if they were their own family, and it's, there's no words. I didn't have any fathom of what the full scope of benefits or the full scope of people that they serve is. They do so much for us because they appreciate what we do for them. No one ever expects that, but they're just so kind and so happy and just willing to do these things because they appreciate the services. They've given all three of our children just the ability to communicate and deal with life and everything that's thrown at them. I think that it would benefit every person that has a problem that they don't know how to fix to just make the call. And I think that CP has a lot more to offer than what most people are aware of. And I think that it's a good asset for the community. It certainly has been for mine. I don't know where my family would be if it was not for the CP. I love the atmosphere that we have. The parents, the kids, they're all great. I just like to see the joy that it brings the family. You know, even if it's, you target one goal in a session, just the happiness it brings to these families and these children. That's, that's why I come here. That's why I love doing what I do. Thank you, CP, for all you've done. Thank you, Noel. Michelle, I miss you. I just want to come back because it's fun. Thanks, CP, for helping me.